What's up, guys? Welcome back to the Horror After Dark YouTube channel. If you aren't already, hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell for post notifications. You don't want to miss a single video on the future. But today, guys, we are breaking down everything Season 2 of Chucky. And yeah, we're just going to give our overall thoughts of the season, our favorite and least favorite kills and moments. And let's just hop into it, Austin. Straight off the top. How did you feel overall about season two? Did you think it was better than the first season? Or, like, what did you feel about it? I have a feeling it was on par with season one. But I kind of had a feeling that some improvements needed to be made on season two. What about you? I mean, I completely agree with that. At moments, it was better than season one. Uh, like, I like the characters and the interactions between them a lot more than season one. I love the fact that Tiffany and uh, Nika played a bigger part in this season and even got their own episode dedicated to them, unlike season one. So in aspects, this was better than season one, but in a lot of other aspects, it also fails to make a mark on the first season. I would have to agree, um, but I, it's kind of cool that they had, and I know I'm kind of sounding biased here because I'm a huge WWE fan. It was awesome to have WWE superstar Liv Morgan on the show and have Chucky actually kill her off. You know, I'm actually finding it funny that they actually went through with that after she asked. Uh, you know, but yeah, she is now a part of the Chucky lore forever now, I suppose. But uh, overall, I would like to say each and every individual episode, in my opinion was good there wasn't one episode that was blatantly like bad like some of the first season episodes but where the first season succeeded it succeeded and went way above the mark where when some episodes were good it just didn't really hit the peak that season one episodes hit so in my opinion i would like to say this season was good but not season one good but it's close. Yeah, it's close. It's close. It's on par, but it's not close. But, you know, Austin, I want to know what your favorite uh, season or favorite season two episode was and what made it your favorite. Ooh, this is a tough question. I'm going to let you answer that question first. You know what? I'm going to have to go. It was either season uh, two, episode four or five, where uh, we had the whole uh, Tiffany Nika episode with the murder mystery. I believe that to be my favorite episode, just for the sense that it was super creative and went, uh, you know, a different route than what the rest of the season took. I would have to agree. I also have to agree as well. That is my actually my favorite episode because it's straight away from the Chucky aspect of it and it focused more on tiffany and more on nika i really uh, like how I they did that and straight away from the chucky story i mean and at the end of that episode we also seen jennifer tilly trapped in the tiffany doll and then at the very very end jennifer tilly actually dies in the episode as well like her physical form like, her soul and everything trapped in a Tiffany doll gets hit by a semi-truck and explodes. Like, we actually get the death of a major character. I know, and that kind of took me by surprise. Now, let me ask you this. And on Your top of favorite that, before kill... you ask me that, I would also like to announce that it also had a very star-studded cast. It did. We had a lot of good stars I mean, in this including, including Jennifer Tilly's own sister. Yeah, I thought that was awesome and the icing on the cake for season two. Now, but anyways, to the main, your... my question is, what was your favorite kill from this season? Damn, my favorite kill from this season. Oof, you know, God, okay, you know what? I'm going to let you start this one out since you had me start out the last question. Okay. My favorite kill, I would have to say, dang, this is a tough one. Um, you brought this on I'm yourself. Gonna... <laughs> I'm going to say Father Bryce. I have to say Father Bryce. It was really, really cool to see him go out with a bang. And literally, he literally went out in a bang. <laughs> like, literally, he tried to exercise the Chucky doll, only for Chucky to reverse it on him. 
and make Father Brace explode. Oh, my goodness. But I had one nitpick about that kill. You know, I think I already know what your nitpick is because I agreed that they played it back way too many times and showed off how fake it was. If they played it once, I think the explosion aspect was the best kill in the uh, series so far. But the fact that they replayed it so many times just, just in my opinion, ruined it. Yeah. And in my opinion, I had a uh, runner-up, my favorite kill. What was the name of the orange-haired girl that hung out with um like oh uh, nadine nadine yeah she had a really brutal kill where chucky pushed her off and it was like a statue with his hands out and then it was the crying jesus or the crying mary statue holding nadine's body yes oh we also forgot about another uh great kill uh where the Young uh, boy gets his uh, heart and uh, heart ripped out or by the buff Chucky. Ah, oh, those are my three favorite kills within the uh, within Here's season two. two. Yeah, I think honestly, I gotta switch mine to that big chest hole scene. Like that was just amazing, well done, and just or kind of out of nowhere. So you know, I'm gonna have to go with that aesthetically, but impactful i would have to still give it to father bryce so father bryce and i forget his name but the young boy who gets a hole punch through his chest is both my favorite kills for different reasons my least favorite kill of the season is going to go to nadine she was my favorite character uh i honestly found her death to come out of nowhere for no reason. I mean, to be honest, she ran away from the group stupidly, ran up stupidly, and believed Chucky over a ledge stupidly. And, and let me say it one more time. She got thrown over the ledge. Uh, you know what I'm going to say here now? Stupidly. That Why was, are you... death was stupid. It was preventable. I know it was preventable, but you have to admit, though, it was, it a was good really kill. cool. It was a good kill, yes, but still preventable. So, therefore, just kind of like, you know, not really a reason. It was just kind of a reason to get her off. Uh, but the worst kill aesthetically is having to go to the uh, nun that is the second kill in the se- or season where she dies from a heart attack. Honestly, Chucky had nothing to do with that besides scaring her. She practically just died of a heart attack. The kills in the season, I think you're going to have to agree with, are hit or miss in the season. There are some phenomenal Mm -hmm. kills, but then you got some kills where, you know, the little, or Jake's foster brother in the beginning of the season dies off screen. We have the nun who dies from a heart attack. We have uh, the uh, priest who gets choked out with his necklace in the confessional booth. Like, oh, off screen, uh, you know, backseat characters. And as Austin and me hate backseat characters, as you all know. I agree. Now, if I had to rate the kills on a one to five, I'm going to give it a four. I'm giving it a three. They're hit or miss. Yeah, and that's why I'm giving it a four because some of them were hit and miss, some were off screen. So, yeah, that's why it's a four. If the kills were more on screen, I'd probably bump the rating to a four and a half. You know, overall, I do enjoy uh, the direction this season went. I hope to see more variation like they did with this season and next season, uh, which season three is uh, aired uh, to fall fall of 2023 so fall of this year season three will premiere and we will be back at it again with season three episodes for you guys and yeah i can't wait for that but overall there were a lot of heartfelt moments throughout this season and i think my favorite moment this season when is nadine came back as an angel to talk to lexi about the drugs and everything I would have to agree, and I don't want you to lie to me on this. weren't you weren't you trying weren't you almost crying like a little baby when that happened? <laughs> Fuck you, but yes. <laughs> Fuck you, but yes. Austin, uh, I I have to recall, weren't you two? You you literally told me you agreed. Well, I do agree, but I wasn't crying like oh, you were. No, no, no. You can't talk to me like that. You you were almost crying too, big game. Try to act tough. I'm gonna call you out for your blog. Well, I just hold you out for your bluff, too, so you got no reason to talk. But anyways, guys, uh, we're going to sit here and go to the uh, overall ratings for the season and end Austin's uh, 
Austin plugs. And yeah, I have to give this season a high mm-hmm. 7.5 out of 10. It ended on a cliffhanger with Nika uh, spying on our Tiffany. And we also mm-hmm. see that Tiffany resurrected Chucky after he was presumed dead, who disguised himself as a bell doll. So yeah, can't wait to see where season three lies, but a 7.5 out of 10 for me, a guaranteed must watch of a season. Austin, what about you? I would have to agree. 7.5 is reasonable, nothing higher. Now, if the kills were not hit and miss and more on screen, it could have rated a bit higher. But considering the kills were off screen and some of the kills were hit and miss, the rating kind of drops for me a little bit. But a 7.5, is reasonable. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and get your awesome plugs. Well, before I do, I need to ask, what are you guys still doing here listening to us talk about season two of Chucky? Go watch the season, guys. Go, go watch, watch it. It, it is free. free. Or you can buy it. Just make sure you go watch it. Some of the episodes yeah, are free on YouTube. Yeah, go watch it. Good Lord. All right. Well, you heard me and Joe talk about season two of Chucky. We broke it down for you guys. Now it's your guys' turn. Let us know what you think in the comments. Uh, Let us know if we missed anything, too. But, yeah, leave your thoughts in the comments. And if you missed our previous video, click that link in the description box below. Check it out and check us out next time. We have a whole new horror after dark for you guys. Joe, is there anything you want to add before we sign off? Uh, No, but our next video will be a fan film Tuesday. And we are also going to be doing more videos on games. So be ready for that. But yeah, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Be sure to check us out for our next video, and we'll see you guys again real soon.